Hey, what's going on everyone? I hope you're having a good day. Today, I'm going to talk to you about why I believe that if you're a Forex trader, you should be up in the charts by 6 a.m. This is mostly going to apply for those who trade uh, European and U.S. currency pairs because, again, there is a point in the morning where both the U.S. market is open as well as the, the European market. And that is around 8 a.m. to like 11 a.m. in the morning in New York time. So usually, if you want to capture a lot of these high volume trades, uh, then you should be participating around 8 in the morning till 11 a.m. However, I believe that you should be up even earlier than that and actually be on the charts by 6 in the morning. Because you should be on the charts by 6 in the morning, you should actually be getting up around 5 or 5.30 just to get your morning stuff prepared. And this whole idea came to be because the other day I was watching a Forex documentary where a lot of these people who trade for, you know, hedge funds, they show up to work at 6 a.m. But this is in London, right? So 6 a.m. London for the markets to start. And I always wondered, like, why did they have to put in so many unnecessary hours? But then I came to the realization that perhaps maybe it's not such a waste of time after all. Maybe they are setting up their trades, their plan for the for the latest market conditions. You just need plenty of time to set up your analysis so that you're ready to go for whatever happens in the market. Whether if it goes up or down, you know what you're going to do. I know for me, the way I analyze the market. I like to take my time and make sure I get all the details correct. So I usually like to give myself an hour in the morning to analyze, which is why I hop into the charts around 6 a.m. Um, so then I'm ready to go by seven. Because what I've tend to realize is that usually when I'm up in the evening, like I'm usually setting up my trades for the next morning. However, overnight, as you may know, the Asian session starts as well as a little bit of the European session. So by the time I get in around 6 a.m., there's already some activity uh, happening. If you are considering treating this like an actual business and trying to treat this seriousness ser seriously, then I believe you should be on the markets by 6 a.m. Not to disregard everyone's trading styles. Of course, everyone is a little different. If you're just starting out trying to learn the markets, then giving yourself ample time before, you know, the U.S. opens, getting on at 6 should give you ample time to analyze and mark up your chart. The point is that you are ready to go by 7. I have noticed by trading European and U.S. currency pairs is that around 7 is usually when the U.S. markets are set to open in an hour. So what the European session tends to do, and again, this is, I'm just basing it off my experience, is that it tends to be more active because they are anticipating uh, the opening of the U.S. market. So yeah, this goes, uh, this, this is more like a, a heads up video if you trade Euro and U.S. pairs, right? And you know that at a certain time of the day, at 8 in the morning here in New York time, both the U.S. and European markets are open. So there's a lot of volatility, a lot of volume, a lot of participants working together or against to build market structure. So to reiterate, being a consistent trader doesn't have to just be analyzing the markets the same way over and over again. Being a consistent trader can also be waking up in the morning consistently, logging into the charts at a certain time consistently, and just being able to treat this as a job and as a business so that you have set amount of hours throughout the day where you're open and close, just like a real business. And maybe even catch some, a couple of trades here in the, in the last hour of the Euro session. There is still some good activity around seven in the morning for Euro and US currency pairs. If you're trying to be up to speed with the markets and you're trying to have enough time to get your day ready and have your markups going i believe that you should be on the charts by 6 a.m all right that's all i want to share with you today let me know what you think down in the comments if you have any opinions about that and i'm curious to know what time that you open up your business you know from what time to what time do you work we know that as well yeah i'll see you in the next one and yeah good luck trading